It really has been a hot minute since we've been here. Hello and welcome everyone. It is me, the Laval, also known as the Power to Do List, back for you with another video. On a Moftronic Rank Grind, um, after, oh, Jesus Christ, two weeks of delay almost, I feel like, uh, we are back. I have grinded the account back up to gold 3. Funnily enough, this is also the day where Tillamans are released in Master Duel. So maybe we'll see those. Um, I'm thinking before we like hop into rank, I do want to make one quick change to the main deck. Um, I'll probably cut down on a scopen for a copy of Cross Out Designator, since we are playing Ash in the main. Um, we'll just see how this works, and if it doesn't, you know, I think maybe we'll, we'll do we cut an Ash for like a Imperm? Nah, I think we'll keep the three Ash. Um. We'll just see how this works, get into ranked, and, uh, you know, just as always, see how far we can take this. Oh, that is a hand. Oh. <laughs> First game. Hmm. Uh, I think we just hold this, right? Or do we? I mean, to be fair, this is like, I don't know, we'll, we'll try and ash this. I've never played against Tierlement before. Um, I am way too casual of a air on it has a corp anyways. Okay, so like it didn't matter L plus ratio Triggers the beast here. Are we getting winded? <laughs> Are we getting winded? <laughs> that is probably the crime that the guy searched earlier. We draw of course the gadget hauler Hmm I mean, we kind of, you know, have to duster the crime here, just so we don't have to worry about that. Mm, I don't think there's a whole lot of interaction on this board. Correct me if I am wrong. The problem is, like, that the Shizu Shufflers on the grave kind of hose me. Get a south one. I mean, we do run into an issue rather quickly with this line, but um, let's not talk about that. Um, can't really do much in this deck when your graveyard's like under constant attack. Um, I'm considering smartphone. The problem is like every uh, um, every like line that I take with the telephone is like dead on arrival because of the Ishizu shufflers. So I think we take smartphone and just see what we can find. Uh, even if it's like not a good line at all. Um, though that still leaves us vulnerable to the Ishizu Shuffler. Huh. Let's try and make a formula synchron. See if we can't like dig up any other Mothronic name here. Mm. So that hand definitely was one of the hands of all time. We draw another name, that's pretty good. We'll go repair unit here. We'll pitch self on. He probably chains a shuffler here. Because we do target the self on. Doesn't chain a shuffler, okay, that is interesting. That is very interesting. We go south on here, you know. I am very confused. Honestly, I'm like 10 minutes in and I couldn't tell you what the fuck happened that game. Jesus Christ. <laughs> What a game that was. Also, first game post tier release. Instantly we play against tier. That is very comedic. Um, yeah, let me take a quick look here. Uh, I think a lot of you will probably see this one coming. Because um, this would make for quite a good addition to the deck. I'm just trying to think how and where we fit this in. 
or even if we fit this in. I think we'll, we'll maybe, you know, put, put Shen Shen on hold, see how much tier limit we'll, we'll be seeing, and then, like, adapt depending on, like, you know, what happens, I guess. We're going second once more. That is, that is not good. Oh. Well, thanks, Konami. Very cool. I guess I won't have to go second that game. Um, Mr. Konami, your check is in the mail. These, um, these are cards. Yeah, these are definitely cards. These are definitely cards. I don't think we Ash Illusion. If anything, I think we Ash the Souls Effect to send. Um. Wait, this is actually Dark Magician. <laughs> I thought this was like Spiral Metal Foes or like some other deck that plays like a Souls Engine. But no, this is dead ass Dark Magician. Normal Summon Rod. Um. Yeah, we Ash Rod. Like. One bazillion percent we ash rod. Uh, we had the best name possible, so like uh, I guess that is a very quick concede from our opponent. Uh, interesting. I guess we take those. <laughs> I guess we do take those. That's a pretty good. That is a. That is, that is, those are, yeah, those are cards. Um, go ahead, summon the Gadget Gamer here. Uh, use the effect to grab a level 1 machine. A blows. I funnily enough have to caught by this. Because otherwise I do not have a play. Because we have once again drawn the Gadget Hauler. I, I am insanely good at drawing one of today. For a telephone, we do summon that in defense. Because I I do want to see if I can't like mill a Moftronic to potentially banish for the smartphone. Mm, telephone is, uh, a pretty good one though. Um, I think we'll mill this cell phone. But the rest on the bottom, I don't think there was like anything crazy there. Or like nothing we can't just like grab off of power tool here. Issues with the smartphone, I kind of have to take like either a telephone or a cell phone out of rotation, which is a bummer. I think it's telephone. It looks weird, but I think it's telephone. Smartphone here, hoping we find a name. That's a pretty good name. Um, grab the remote. Make crystal wing. Mm, in hindsight, it should have been cell phone. Because we could have gone telephone, smartphone again. And get more value in that way. I guess now we kind of have to pray that the cell phone hits something good. Six is a pretty good one. Scopin's also kind of neat. Yeah, I guess we take Scopin here. We make Musashi. And then we go Musashi for, I think it's smart. No, it's Gadget Gamma. It's absolutely Gadget Gamma. It is absolutely Gadget Gamma. It ain't much, but uh, let's hope this keeps us alive. Part of duality. It is indeed Fluanderies. Drew map, just that good at the game. Royal Rare Robina. 
I don't think there's a good point to interrupt this. Unless, like, screws up and has no bird banish when he goes to summon the M-Pen. But I think even then we're kind of screwed, right? Because this was all off of map. So, so it has the, you know, normal normal summon. I think we hit Mpen, if anything. Oh wait, we can't, because Mpen, ne M -Pen ne negates the, the crystal wing, so I guess we have to hit Eglin. Uh, Flunder is, Flunder is a deck. Flunder really... Flunder really is a deck. Where's well, like the optimal play to like interrupt Flunder then? I guess you could hit Robino. Wait, that is very greedy. Right? I mean, still has like, you know, the normal normal summon and gets to like, unexplored wins. But I feel like we crystal wing the three. That's that off the field, yeah. Tributes to for Mpen. Mpen adds unexplored wins. We, you know, channeling to Robina. Oh, we click all the buttons, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ, that is three sets. That is a lot of set cards. That is a top deck. Mm, I guess we'll go Feather Duster here. Probably chains like, yep, yeah, you know, Dreaming Town just to, you know, chain it. Also chains Book of Moon, targeting the Musashi. For Robina. Although at least like he has to go through the the thunder line now. The only issue would be if uh, he ends up making like Apex Avian specifically. Tributes two for the Mega Riser. Outs the Musashi, puts back the power tool. Interesting. Uh, the problem is we're still under M-Pen. We go Gadget Gamer here, we go Gadget Gamer Effect. For a smartphone. I do have a way to out Mpen, funnily enough. I guess we, we just, you know, click a couple buttons, see what what happens. Um Pop the smartphone on the board in defense. That is by the way a very wasted effect. Um because of what I was about to do. Doesn't really matter, so we just put these to the bottom. Should have not done this um yeah because our next line is machine duplication target gadget gamer we grab the other two copies uh and then we do indeed 
make a jump scare. Uh, we go underworld goddess here. I think we bonk the mega riser. See what happens. Yeah, I shouldn't just have clicked the button on the smartphone there. Because that would have been a very crazy s stack if we were able to like secure a, s a telephone or like a cell phone for a follow up turn. Um, but we'll see how far Underworld Goddess gets us. Once again, you know, a staple. Uh, unexplored wins is cr kind of cringe here. But from the looks of it, there doesn't seem to be much gas in the tank. Problem is we need to find something that applies pressure here. Converter is not it. Uh, those, uh, he simply will not find a bird. There just isn't any birds, you know? They just, you know, left for the winter. Uh, so that is a thing. A smartphone's a pretty good one. Smartphone is a pretty good one. I will go summon smartphone here. Do we have a link reborn grave? Oh, we don't. That is very sad. That is very sad. Ah, Ash Blossom, not the card I needed. We'll go Converter here. Hope that there is no Book of Moon in our future. There is no Book of Moon in our future, very nice. So we will go Telephone here to get that smartphone back. I can also grab Telephone here uh, because we can take the Unicorn as three materials and this Telephone here to make access integration. It's a Crossout Designator. Yeah, we'll go Axis for 53. And we go Jump Scare for game. <laughs> I guess Underworld Goddess uh, once again makes an appearance and puts in work. Just an incredibly cool card. Really like that card on this deck, especially with like how easy it is to put just enough bodies on the board where you can just be like, yep, yoink. And there goes one of your opponent's end board pieces. That was a pretty good game. Wow, that is gas. That is that is a lot of gas. Uh, we'll go Gadget Gamer here. I feel like there's almost no hand trap here that, I, that I'm really afraid of. Because we just have like all gas in hand. We go telephone here. Mm. Although scratch that, uh, Ash on the gadget gamer here is pretty unfortunate. Which is why I think we do this. It looks weird, but uh, just like in many cases, there is method to the madness. Uh, because this way, if uh, he ends up having the ash, I still have enough bodies on board to make a platinum gadget. So we can go gadget gamer here. There's the ash. There is the ash. There is the ash. Uh, there is the ash. Um, okay, we don't get Gadget Hauler then, but we do still have enough bodies on board to make a copy of Platinum Gadget. Uh, let's Platinum Gadget here. I do believe we go for the classic, the OG. We go for the world famous play. We go Machine Duplication Target Morphtronic Cellphone. A play as old as time. And now we, I guess, get it twisted and do a little bit of gambling. 
We fight Telephone, that's a pretty crazy one. Yeah, I think it's Telephone, like, no questions asked. We go Phoenix and try to aim for an Apollosa here. Once again, you know, throwing away our favorite Link too. Mm, I think we don't even get, like... Oh, we do get... Yo, we get a surrender out of our opponent. Let's go. Rewarded for taking a high role play, I guess. Very, very nice. I do take that. I feel like I deserve that goal too there. I feel like... I feel like I played that very well, you know. I may not always play optimally, but I might, you know, give my li myself a little tap on the shoulder for that one. You want to end things on, like, a high note. I feel like that game was pretty good you know even if it was you know short and sweet but uh let's see what going second uh gives us this time that's a pretty good grip i don't think that's like terrible playing into a board with oh 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 um is this another one of those ishizu decks that potentially also contain t element cards yes indeed because there is a rhino heart but I think we have, like, a lot of gas to, like, potentially cook with. Because we're looking at cell phone for extenders. So, like, that's that's pretty freaking good, you know? Uh, this is also, like, a learning experience from me. As mentioned at, like, the start, I've never played against this deck or, like, looked into this, you know, in depth. So, like, uh, this is, like, people discovering color TV or some shit. Cal back here, he... No! He dunks on, he dumps the cell phone. That is so sad. Please tell me you put the cell phone back. I would be very happy if you put the cell phone back. I'm playing a graveyard deck, but I'm suddenly now realizing that I could not give a shit about Abyss Dweller. It's also funny how makes dweller against like a deck that doesn't do like a whole lot with it <laughs> or where it doesn't do like a whole lot uh i think we try and maybe fish for that uh, rucolos with a junk box uh we'll target self on here problem is we still have the one ishizu shuffler oh no we don't have a shuffler anymore in grave i mean to be fair now now there's a mudora which is a problem and we get max seed which is an even bigger problem. <laughs> uh, Soliac. Okay, that's effect. Send a monster control to the grave. That is cute. That is very cute. Sends Merly to the grave. We still have Rukalos live. And this Merly might hit something. Although I don't think Merly actually needs to hit anything here. Since, you know, the whole gang's in the graveyard already. And we make window. And we make window. Um. Hmm. Window certainly is a card. <laughs> and bait a bait something with a reborn here. We don't. That is an issue. Hmm. Although we can just, like, normal make a... Oh, we can't. We're on the window. <laughs> um, shit. Yeah, how do I deal with window? <laughs> huh. Call it cope or whatever. But I feel like if there wasn't... An El Shadal window right there. We would be cooking. <laughs> I guess we can grab Remoten. If that even, you know, resolves. Like you Rukalos is this. That is interesting. That is rather interesting. Oh sad but as we have the one cell phone in hand. So we still can't 
realistically put like enough bodies on the board to make oh, I would kill for a Cerberus right now I would kill for a Cerberus right about now oh can't be destroyed by opponent's card effect screw that um Winder is a card Jesus Christ um hmm where do we take this where do we where do we take this I don't think far. <laughs> that is the problem. I mean, I guess we can convert her here. We can convert her, put back the south on. Summon like... Telephone from the deck. go telephone here main thing I want to do here is stack a cell phone to the bottom of the deck uh, no we put or like rather you know we can put that away from the top so we go uh, uh, um, I think we go smartphone gamer gamer hauler dupe cell phone and then we pretty much set the boomboxen. And yes, I sat here for like a long time in front of Winda and was very sad. But I guess we hope we just live through this. Otherwise, we do have an issue. And there is the Palerino. That is a problem. Because that pops a monster. Pops a card if a tier element is shuffled back. Oh, that is terrible. That is absolutely terrible. Mills, Squamata, Agito. Jesus Christ. I guess for the next couple episodes, we do have a deck to metagame around. Um, but, yeah. I think we really should have just I, I I should really start you know just ending episodes when I just did something smart and not not risk getting paired up against here although I I I, I would say this until my dying breath I think if there was not a window on that board we would have been in that game absolutely because no way does he have like enough interaction even with the maxi to be like yes I can stop Salphon for extenders. Um, but yeah, sadly didn't make gold one, but I think we will make a couple changes to the deck since we did, you know, see a couple tier decks. Maybe see if we can't, you know, put the Shen Shen, which would be a, a very funny tech inclusion for me. Um, but that is a League of Legends reference that probably not a whole lot of you would get. Uh, anyways, <laughs> my toxic side hobbies aside <laughs> i still hope you enjoyed this episode uh we're back on the rank grind uh let me know what you thought of this video down below i always like hearing your guys' thoughts to this series um maybe especially on the shen shen i feel like i feel like shen shen is probably like the best option you have in the deck bearing like heralds of the arc light i think that's also like another option to like make um but we'll see maybe maybe you can you guys can decide on that in the comments what is like easier or better to make in the deck uh, i feel like herald's just like you make it and it gets to run over shen shen's at least like a, a chunky boy you know uh but we'll see about that next episode i feel like so with that out of the way i will thank you guys very much for watching and see you guys again next time but until then goodbye